I'm Brandon. And I'm Trevor. And, and we are Tradition, Tradition Home. So, 2016 is upon us. Yep. Season has begun. We're going to do our little mini display thing. We're going to be building that over the next few weeks. Yep. Though we are not going to have as many videos, we're not really going to lack on the detail. It'll be really fleshed out. Uh, we, you know, we have a whole blueprint to show you, a whole little what it's going to look like, the facade. We're going to be working that. We're going to be working on that today. Yeah, I don't know. I, I feel like we've mentioned it before, but we are recreating the whole, the whole house facade. Yeah, um, we're doing it. And this is going to be just as awesome. Um, actually, I think better because we're, oh, yeah, we're, we're, we're planning on, on making it much bigger. So we figure, we figure we're doing a smaller display. We need to, we need to go all out with this one. Yeah, Not that we always don't, but whoa. <laughs> And this is where we begin. We have four of these total right over there. We're gonna put these long ways, gonna cut them in half, and we're gonna actually make them fit to a panel, which is gonna be a little bit of a pain, but overall a lot easier than the original uh, siding that we actually did, which was all custom pieces that we put on, kind of like a you know real siding on a house. This will just make it a lot more accessible, in my opinion, just a lot easier. Um, it's just all wood. Uh, it's gonna be a lot lighter. We've noticed that over time that it's just impossible to carry the house pieces. It takes almost three people to do it. I'm gonna frame it all with two by fours. We actually bought those the other day. Uh, gonna do that. That's gonna be the whole first day, pretty much, is just the facade. We'll be cutting the windows out, uh, the doorway, we actually have a door I'll show you it in the backyard there's a it's a screen door that my dad actually got from one of his jobs probably paint and detail will actually get done today as well that shouldn't be too much since we put up the whole ship at Midsummer Scream got that done in two days and then moving over here is the other newest addition to the haunt this is my new whip I call it the Batmobile all my hard work at Pizza had finally paid off uh, of course, the pizzas are going to be going in the trunk, not inside the car. I don't want that shit at all. But I actually bought it from a guy that goes to my school up in Orange, not too far away. Finally be riding in style. So no more truck for me. Finally retiring that. After all these years you've seen, it's actually my dad's truck right there, which was one of the reasons I actually did it because, uh, you know, it was just time to move on. And we have this truck for supplies and stuff, which is actually what we moved that stuff in. Uh, wasn't a big deal, but my old truck finally kicked the bucket uh, The transmission went out and it just didn't make any sense to invest in that. So I just got something new So right now I'm gonna give you guys a look at the facade uh, The drawing of it and kind of tell you what's going on with everything So for the most part, it's gonna be pretty much the same as what it originally was uh, Another house facade. It's gonna be updated. It's gonna be 16 feet wide with longer thinner windows We have a new door to put on there. It's gonna be a little bit thinner as well The the doorway is probably gonna be a few inches thinner than the original one color should be a little bit darker this time I'm looking to do something a little more uh, Old like a little older looking the original color was kind of a one that we we made ourselves We just mixed a whole bunch of paints. We're gonna do something uh, a little bit darker this time make it look a little more runny and and old like it's been rained on and it's just been in the forest or whatever up here we actually have uh, basically a second story type thing it's gonna be a, like a, an extension of the roof like a like a second roof as opposed to what we've been doing uh, for the last few years where it's just the the main roof and then that's that's the whole house altogether at the peak of the house it's gonna be about 12 feet high right there in the middle uh, there's gonna be the little vent as well. We were gonna do a window. We were we were kind of playing with that. Or actually there's gonna be two windows and then we just decided to just um, do the vent. We actually we bought the vent as well. A lot more of a project I think this time. Just a lot more uh, detail aside from the fact that the siding is gonna be a little bit easier uh, to manage now that it's just you know one actual piece. Well it was three pieces but as opposed to the original siding that jutted out on the sides uh, we didn't we didn't really like that. It was it was very heavy and we, we didn't look forward to ever uh, doing anything with that. You can see some trims right here. There's uh, around the windows, around the doorway. I like that. I, I think uh, that would look really cool. The deck will pretty much be the same. We're going to rebuild it again just because we want to go all the way with this and redo all of it since it's the only thing that we're really doing this year. Since we've never done it before, I would like to put uh, plexiglass on the two windows. Not the thin stuff since we don't have any of that ordered and we had to do that last year. We had to order a bunch of it in bulk and Adam went and picked it up. We're just going to go to Home Depot and get like two pieces that are relatively thin. Put that, maybe do some the bars right here on the, on the windows and, and then, you know, fog them up and, and make them look, you know, gross and old and dirty. But that is our project. There it is. Nice and beautiful. <sighs> Just like always. Yep. Oh my god, yes. Yeah. I love it. 
Talk about some heavy ass pieces though. Still not as heavy as the originals. I'd say they're as heavy. I do think they are as heavy. But <laughs> just not as awkward. Not awkward. Yeah, those yeah. things are so awkward to freaking grab. <laughs> but yeah, this is gonna be sick. There's the door I told you guys about. So my dad got that <clears throat> from some random dumpster. It is and just shy of 16 feet. It's like 15 point. 985 because of the cuts Cha. so we pretty much went to uh right on point <sighs> on point two by fours for all of this probably two by threes for the rest of the shit i well, would say it's, it's mostly yeah i mean we're we're probably going to use what we already have yeah we we have some set aside i showed them in, in the summer update yep um so we're definitely going to use uh, a lot of those black ones Ugh. oh man daddy <sighs> Yeah, but uh, next thing is painting. Okay. Yeah, second story right there. On top. Um, Be gorgeous. On top of like pretty much the whole thing. And pretty much? Pretty... It's where the top usually goes. Is it? Whoa. <laughs> we're out of it. It's okay. And I have a pretty good idea of how we're going to do it too. Yeah, it was, like I said, it was, uh, so we just laid these f <laughs> down sideways for 16 feet and the seam is right there in the middle and we we're gonna use Adam was saying we should do some like spackle or something and then I don't know we might not listen to him we don't listen to Adam any of that time yeah <laughs> <laughs> what but, great ideas he have <laughs> he's gonna watch this and be like <laughs> I eat cheese off some girl's titties. All right, detail is finished for the most part. Uh, a little bit of the spray, probably do a little bit more once everything is done. I mean, I always end up touching it up, but I think this color is a lot better than the one we used to have. It was a lot brighter for that one, uh, where there's gonna be like a trim right here and right there. Did some more like dark running detail right there along with the door as well. My idea is to put like branches and stuff right in front of it, just like clawing onto there, like just vines and stuff that are just hanging down, probably off of where the roof will be as well. I think that'll look really cool. The color on the inside will be different than this. Uh, it might be lighter or a, a variation of this color. This is, I think it's called Whiskey Barrel, this is the color. I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. Probably in the next video is when I'll actually do the trims and stuff. We just have to build the next part right there, like we said earlier. Um, it's gonna be the same shit with the, the paint. The paint is still like three quarters full, so we'll probably just end up using that. It can probably do a double coat since it'll only be uh, two pieces to do that part. Biggest pain in the ass was just not getting it on my actual house. That was pretty annoying. Towel right there, that really did a lot. <laughs> it takes a little while. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 42. This Saturday, we're going to be at Halloween Horror Nights. If you guys want to meet up with us, it's going to be the 24th. We're going to be down there. We'll be in our Perdition Home shirts. If you guys have tickets on that day, meet awesome. Up. Yeah. I mean, shoot us uh, shoot us something, a message on Facebook. Yeah. And, us, um, whatever. 
maybe we'll post something on Facebook. So pay attention, um, saying like, hey, at, at whatever Instagram. time, yeah, and, and Instagram at whatever time, uh, we're we'll plan to be at like the Panda Express to get food or something. I don't know. You know, we'll we'll post something that we'll, we'll have on. a time and location. Um, and if any of you guys are going, yeah, you know, please come say hi. Um, if you were thinking about going, the tickets on that day are very cheap. They're much cheaper than the rest of the day, so I would they recommend... May, they may sell out, though. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah, they might sell out. It is Saturday. So I would recommend uh, doing that. Yeah, they and also people that are actors in it. If you're acting in, in any of the mazes, you know, look out for us. We'll be going through Yep. Please say hi to us. All right, so, so the info is in the description. <laughs> and... Uh, That's it. <laughs> Where's Trevor? He's not here, bitch. Do you see his car? I don't know. Hiding. He doesn't hide, puss. <laughs> see? <laughs> I was waiting. Are you, are you videotaping? <laughs> oh, we did. <laughs> you're going to hit it one of these days and you're going to pay for it.